Good day everyone, let's solve these simultaneous equations. As you can see, the first equation is quadratic because it has an x squared term and the second equation is linear. So we are going to substitute for x into the first equation using the second equation. So x is equal to y plus 2. Instead of x squared, we write y plus 2 squared is equal to 4 take away y. As you can see, we have replaced x, I'm circling it, by y plus 2. So, we have to expand these brackets. So, we have y plus 2 squared is equal to y plus 2 times y plus 2. And that is equal to 4 take away y. y times y is y squared. y times 2 is 2y. 2 times y is 2y, 2 times 2 is 4, and that is equal to 4 take away y. We want to get all of the letters on the left hand side, so let's simplify this. y squared plus 2y plus 2y is 4y plus 4 is equal to 4 take away y. We want to subtract 4 from both sides of the equation, so they cancel. And then you want to add y to both sides. So we'll have y squared plus 4y plus y is equal to 0. So y squared plus 4y plus y will be simplified. So y squared plus 5y is equal to 0. We now factorize, taking out the y. So we have y into y plus 5 is equal to 0. There are two possibilities here. y could be equal to 0 or y plus 5 could be equal to 0 and in that case y would be equal to negative 5. So when y is equal to 0 we have to work out the value of x. So we have x is equal to y plus 2. We are using this equation here that I have circled. And we substitute y is equal to 0 here. So you get x is equal to 0 plus 2, which is 2. And when y is equal to negative 5, we substitute for y here. So we have x would be equal to negative 5 plus 2. So x will be equal to negative 5 plus 2 is negative 3. So these are our answers. y equals 0, x equal 2, and y equal negative 5, x equals negative 3. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.